Okay, to cut your surface, <clears throat> I'm going to, so because I want to cut um, horizontally and quite precisely, first what I do, I want to find where is the midpoint first, probably. And to find the midpoint, I roughly want to know what is the overall geometry and the volume. And, okay, first of all, I will hide unnecessary thing. To know the approximate volume of the geometry, I use a bounding box command, so called bounding box, and then select object to frame with a box. I click the object and enter, and enter one more time. This will create a box that wrap around any geometries, and then actually you can approximate the dimensions roughly, and then. Because my object snap is on, I will click somewhere middle point. So now that we know that this point is in the middle. So I don't need bounding box, so I delete them. All I need is this point. And I will draw a curve, left here, left button, and start a point. And then using shift button, I draw a horizontal line and enter. And then I'm using this curve for our cutting line. To cut a geometry, I will use split function and enter. Select object to split. So I'll select my column and enter. And select cutting object, which is our this cutting line, and enter. So now your surface is divided into two. Now we have a problem. What is the problem? It's not close anymore. Yes, it's not close anymore. So, how can I create a surface? Yeah, the silhouette and planar surface and join. So, you got the idea? Okay, so I will do that. So, I will, uh, okay, I will close this one.